All right, anatomy and physiology students, just a quick review of the tissues of the respiratory system. Here we've got a cross section across the trachea, so the air would be going up and down through the trachea in this space here, and we're looking at the wall of the trachea, very low power. You can see the cartilage that forms most of it, and that nice ciliated epithelium on the surface. If we look uh, at a close higher magnification, again, you can see the nice hyaline cartilage with its cells in those lacunae, um, and of course on the surface that pseudostratified columnar epithelium with the cilia. I think they'll show it to us even higher power. There you can see goblet cells producing mucus on the surface of the epithelium, the cilia themselves, and of course that strat pseudostratified epithelial layer, and then the cartilage down here, a submucosa carrying blood vessels and nerves to the tissue. This is showing a close-up of the cartilage where you can see the, the chondrocytes in their lacunae. And this is showing the beautiful view of that ciliated epithelial tissue right on the surface there of the trachea, on the inner surface of the trachea. Pseudostratified columnar epithelium with cilia and goblet cells. Okay, this is looking at a cross section of the lung tissue now, or just a cut through the lung tissue, um, where you can see all of the alveolar sacs in there, and um, maybe some bronchioles and blood vessels running through there. This is a close up of the bronchial, but you can really nicely see the alveolar sacs with their squamous, simple squamous epithelial lining. Um, this is showing smooth muscle around the bronchioles, and um, there's an artery. This is a really nice view of the um, of an alveolus right there, the inner, the, the little air sac space. There's a type 2 cell that produces the surfactant, and a type 1 cell are the typical simple squamous epithelial cells, really thin cells that um, line the inner surface of each alveolus, allowing for that quick, um, that quick, diffusion of oxygen into the into the capillaries and there is one of those capillaries right there with the nice red blood cells um, laid a concave red blood cells running through the capillary right on the surface of the alveolus so that's pretty much it for that nice quick review of the respiratory tissues please be sure to use your wish list as you look through here in order to identify the structures that you really need to know have a good one